This week on Zooborns Australia. Okay. Let's it up here. A vulnerable otter species welcomes four new pups who love showing off in the water for all the zoo guests. It's an exciting day for the Perth Zoo at the Otter Exhibit. A new litter of four Asian small-clawed otter pups were born to Mom Patty and Dad Serdik. Most of the animals here at Perth Zoo are part of uh, breeding programs, whether they're our region or international. And yeah, we uh, are playing a really important role in breeding of these uh, Asian small-clawed otters. We have our new pair here now, Patty and Serdic, and their little babies will probably stay with us until Patty and Serdic have another family uh, because the whole family helps raise up the young otters, so it's a really good experience for these little guys. And then when they're old enough, they'll probably go on to another zoo. Under the watchful eyes of mom and dad, the otter pups live in nest boxes within the exhibit for the first eight weeks after they are born. Otter pups like these are born with their eyes closed and rely on their parents for everything until they're old enough to leave the nest box. After two months, Patty and Serdig are finally emerging with their pups from their nest boxes which means Perth zookeepers will finally get to do their first exam. The young otters are eight weeks old and they have just today started uh, walking around uh, on their own or the first time we're seeing them doing that as a group. Um, so they're definitely growing up. The first exam is critical to learn the sex of the pups, vaccinate them and make sure they are healthy enough to expand the population. As the smallest of the otter population, Asian small-clawed otters are a vulnerable species. They face threats to survival such as habitat destruction, poaching, and being sold on the illegal pet trade. Oh, this is the female. After giving each pup a clean bill of health, the vets learn that there are three healthy boys and a girl named Saigon, Tigga, Bajak, and Ikan. These healthy pups are a victory for the Perth Zoo and the species in their fight against extinction. Back at the otter exhibit, the Asian small-clawed otter pups are ready for their next milestone. Swimming. With so much of their time spent in water, otters rely on their double coats of fur to stay warm. They're doing really well. Mum and Dad, Patty and Serdik are just star parents for first time uh, uh, babies. They do stay together as a big family for a lot longer than uh, some of the otter, otter species. As the pups learn to swim and become more independent, they will become one of the main attractions at the zoo and help visitors understand why these incredible animals are worth saving. Love what you see with baby small-clawed Asian otters? Vote for your favorite zooborn of the season and we'll donate 3,000 US dollars towards conservation efforts for the winning species. Next week on Zooborns Australia, the zoo celebrates the birth of a tree kangaroo who only recently began poking his head out of mom's pouch. <laughs> <laughs>